The Royal Ontario Museum is revamping its image, hoping to change the way people see and think about the more than 100-year-old institution. The brand concept is ROM immortal. We live on in what we leave behind. And the idea is that here at the ROM we have 13 million art objects, artifacts, and specimens, and each one unlocks a story that is relevant to our lives today. It's also uh, connected to the broader idea of, of you know, the actions that we take today, how they have consequences, because what we do today will live on in what we leave behind. ROM executives say the rebrand is the museum's bid to showcase how it continues to be a vital and pertinent part of the city and the country's cultural landscape. But why now? Well, this is a moment in time where we're very excited about encouraging people to come back to culture. You know, after um, years of too much screen time and too little interaction and in real world experiences, uh, we want uh, people to come in to the museum and recharge and feed their souls. With a plethora of events and festivals set to return to the city this summer for the first time since the pandemic hit, the museum is hoping to get in on the action and jumpstart interest in its exhibit and programming. This is about generating voltage in the marketplace that puts ROM sort of top of mind for everybody, uh, but also offering um, a unique experience for the summer where we'll be um, making the entire uh, main floor free. We're able to offer programming and uh, uh, live music and a new pop-up cafe that will uh, give everyone um, a great cultural experience that they can come by and enjoy just on a casual basis. And so it's a place to hang out. We want people to feel like this can be, after a fashion, their living room for the summer. Visitors say that's going to be a big plus. It's going to be a lot more accessible, I think, to people as well, and making it a more public space for people to just come and hang out and having it not be so... Um, I don't want to say like elitist, but not like so like all fancy and stuff. I think it'll draw more people in. You know, a small family, it's still expensive sometimes to do things. And if you can find something free to do, it's a great opportunity to check it out. You can continue to access the main floor of the museum for free through till September. For more on this story, you can go to our website, citynews.ca. For City News, I'm Dilshad Berman.